Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kimberly, also known as Mbali. Thank you so much for tuning in and welcome back to it, family. If you are a returning subscriber, welcome back, Mdaza. And if you are not subscribed, please make sure that you subscribe before you leave this video. So today's video is basically the first episode in a new series that I'm starting on my channel and that is Top 5 in 5. In the series, I'll be mentioning my top 5 in any category. Doesn't have to be makeup related. Any top 5 that I have that I would like to share with you guys, I will mention those top fives and talk you through it and do it in five minutes or less than five minutes or at least five minutes less than six minutes i hope that you guys are going to enjoy this and today as is kind of expected because foundation is literally my favorite thing in makeup i'm doing my top five foundations then let's get straight into this video okay you guys so i do want to mention that these picks are in no particular order it's just in the order that i'm grabbing them on the side over here so it's in no particular order so the first foundation that i'm mentioning and i'm speaking about is the lancome tiny doll foundation that looks like this i absolutely love this foundation and this was actually my first high-end foundation purchase this foundation is really really great and what i love about it is that as the day goes by it literally mixes up with your natural oils that surface onto your skin and it creates this insanely beautiful radiant finish on the face did i say that this foundation is a 24 hour wear and i absolutely believe that because as the day goes by it literally looks so 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 good on the skin it feels like skin it is lightweight it's not cakey it is buildable it is a medium coverage foundation it does claim that you can build it up to a full i haven't really tried because yeah i didn't i didn't think that it was necessary but i love 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 this foundation this foundation is forever going to be a staple i don't reach for it as much right now but it's definitely definitely a staple and definitely my all-time favorite foundation ever since i purchased it okay so it looks like i'm starting with my high-end foundations the next one in that category is the fenty beauty hydrating foundation with absolutely love this i did love the soft matte foundation from fenty but i like this one more because it is hydrating i you would notice that from my picks today i'm more of a hydrating foundation kind of girl instead of a matte i don't have any oily skin i don't have pr problematic skin i have basically normal skin but i love how this foundation and hydrating foundations usually look on the face and this is why this is one of my favorite foundations even though i haven't used it in a very long time but it will stay being my favorite it goes really smoothly and really nicely on the skin fun fact i love mixing the lancome and this fenty beauty foundation together and it gives me this bomb 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 combination do not recommend though but yeah i tried it out once and i loved the way it looked and i stuck with it for a very very long time okay and moving over to my drugstore foundations the next one that is on my top five is this l'oreal 24 hour fresh wear infallible 24 hour fresh wear foundation unfortunately i don't get a lot of use out of this because when i did pick it up i got the wrong shade i really love this foundation it is comparable to the tiny doll actually it is such an amazing full coverage foundation and it is even like watching reviews on youtube from people People's experiences with this foundation they compare it to a lot of high-end foundations I think this is a fantastic foundation it's really really great last throughout the day looks amazing throughout the day gives the fantastic coverage that you really really love and it's a drugstore foundation like what else and what more could you ask for this is a fantastic foundation guys like you don't understand next foundation on my top five I hate to mention because of course we know that NYX is no longer available in South Africa but the next foundation that I'm talking about is the born to glow foundation by NYX the most full coverage foundation that I've ever tried it is a hydrating foundation that's why it's a born to glow it's a hydrating foundation and it is a bit of a it gives a bit of a dewy finish um, so I'm not sure how that would work with someone that is very oily in the skin I know I obviously set it with powder and it worked really well well for my skin and i love how it felt on my skin and i really really think that this performs really well for a drugstore foundation and last but not least on my list is the revlon color stay foundation which is the foundation that i'm wearing today and is the foundation that has been all of the rave and all of the craze lately in south africa because of course we had the competition that revlon is running on this foundation so the foundation claims to be for combination and oily skin and it does say that it's a matte finish i do find however even though it is a matte finish it does 
has come through hydrating it looks like skin it feels really really fresh on the skin um, it is not cakey at all so yeah I really really enjoy that foundation and I'm currently like I mentioned I'm currently wearing it right now okay, so those are my top five foundations and like I said they're in no particular order but if I were to have to pick one foundation and I was told that I can only use this foundation for the rest of my life it would probably be the Lancome Tiny Doll. Okay, guys, that's all I have for today. And really, really hope that you guys enjoyed this little segment or first episode of my series, Top 5 and 5. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. And I will see you guys in my next video. Again, don't forget to like, to comment, and to subscribe. And to get me closer to 2K subscribers because that is currently our goal. And the sooner we reach our goal, maybe we'd be able to do a giveaway. You never know. But thank you so much for tuning in. I will see you guys in my next video. Love and light to you and yours. Bye.